We are the Rock Station 99X. Me, Puff, here, hanging out with you. And joining me in the studio is the lovely, the sexy, the gorgeous, and the wonderfully big busted Sophie D. You meant to say big eyes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I stumble a lot. Uh, she will be at Deja Vu this weekend. Yes. Uh, so, uh, Tell us about your show. Every uh, everybody brings a different bag of tricks to the lovely Deja Vu Hustler Club. So why don't you tell us what what your show's like? It's, what we can expect? It's all interactive. So if there's no one sitting by the stage, I kind of stand there looking like, oh, um, now what? Um, so I pretty much put my boobs in everyone's face. So that's pretty much part of my show. I like that. Yeah, and give out free eight by tens. You can get it out of my boobs or my butt. So I suggest to sit. Right by the stage. It, it sounds like this is one you want to be up front, close, yeah, center for. Yeah, it's not for. far away. My boobs aren't that big to reach. <laughs> well, <laughs> that could be debated, but... Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, you know, I was on your website and saw something interesting. Uh-oh. Uh, you sell panties to, uh, I guess, fans. Yes. How, how does that work? When you sell out, when you run out of stock, do you get a Google alert and just throw it, you know, some dirty laundry in the box? How, how does that function? Well, I'm most of the time I, I wear them all day and I sell them the ones that I'm wearing. Uh-huh. And some clubs, actually, if I'm, when I'm allowed, I'll put the whole panty inside of my, and then get it out and let someone get it that way. But there's different ways of me selling my panties. <laughs> I, I, I can tell. <laughs> Panty hustle. <laughs> um, you know, yeah, how long have you been in the uh, adult industry? Since 04. So you've been in it a, a little while. Yeah. Um, you know, now they call me MILF and I don't even have a kid. It sucks. That's terrible. You don't I look know. that old. I am though. 32. That's kind of old now. Well, I guess for, <laughs> for the job, maybe. <laughs> maybe. But, uh, you know, it, you've been in the business for a while and I know when I do my job, I talk for a living. The last thing I want to do when I get home is talk to anyone. People that work in restaurants, you know, if they work at a pizza joint, the last thing they want to do when they get home is eat pizza. You work in porn. How how does that affect uh, your sex life? Do you still enjoy it? Do you, uh... Yeah, of course they do. I'll right. be having sex in the elevator and stairwells. I still still like it. Well, that's <laughs> awesome. That's Don't always a stop. positive. <laughs> uh, so what? You, uh, I saw that you are a big film buff. I know you do uh, some movie reviews from time to yeah, time. Yeah, I used to have a whole site, but I don't know. I kind of stopped doing it. Well, um, it was really good though. I I enjoy. It. I remember watching a few of your reviews. Um. Have there been any movies that come out recently that you're like, God, that's awesome? I haven't really been to the movie. I'm traveling so much, and like, especially like this one. I came here on a Wednesday. I come home on a Sunday, so I haven't really had time. To, I even missed the purge in theaters, and I was sad. That's terrible. I know. I can see your puppy dog eyes. It makes me want to cry. I don't get to go anymore. <laughs> I don't even get to watch TV. I have to DVR everything. Well, you know, uh, since you are a big film fan, even though you don't get to watch any, uh, one of the big booms, I guess you could say, in the uh, porn industry right now is that, uh, you know, everybody's making porn parodies, parodies of uh, famous movies and stuff. Tons. Is there any that you wish, like, God, I wish someone would put make a porn parody of this and put me in it, like I The Godfather it. or something? I did it. I did The Exorcist. <laughs> what? It was so cool. I can't say that. It was so cool. We got a bleep button. It's okay. Oh, Awesome. But yeah, they had my head spinning, and oh my god, it was amazing. I'm, I'm gonna have to hit the Google box and find that. Yeah, you should. It was really cool. It's for browsers. I, I I can't wait to. <laughs> I'm just blown away that someone made an Exorcist porn parody. It was so cool. They elevated me and everything. Perfect film for Halloween. Yep. And you can probably find it in the Love Boutique at Deja Vu. Maybe. Just look. <laughs> they got plenty of awesome stuff, and I'm sure they have some of your films there too. I hope so. Well, uh, if you're free this weekend, hell, even if you're not, cancel your plans and go yeah. see the lovely Sophie D at Deja Vu Hustler Club. Yep. I know I'm looking forward to it. Dang. I'm going to be front row center with dollar bills. and. You better be. You should get those um, money guns. See, you guys, whoever gets a money gun, maybe I'll give you a free lap dance. You better have to be full. <laughs> Money guns, full free lap dances, <laughs> pictures, panties stuffed everywhere. It's gonna. It sounds like it's gonna be a blast. And if you don't know who I am, go to my Twitter and Instagram at Sophie D.